When you're sitting there in EMT class and your instructor says, shock, 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 all you're gonna hear about is shock hypoperfusion. What does this mean? Shock by definition means your body's organs are not getting enough blood or oxygen. Your organs are not getting enough blood and oxygen. Now, why is this occurring? This is the four types of shocks that we talk about. Number one is cardiogenic shock. That means it's the heart's fault why you're in shock. You either had a heart attack or heart failure. Obstructive shock means the blood flow in the body is obstructed for some reason. May it be pulmonary embolism, tension in the a cardiac tamponade. Blood flow is being obstructed, obstructive shock. Now, distributive shock has three subtypes. We have neurogenic, which is common in trauma. Anaphylactic, we know it's allergic reaction, gone crazy right? Anaphylaxis. And then we have septic. That's literally bacteria in your blood. With those three types, watch out for severe hypotension. Okay. Now the final one is hypovolemia. That's the classic, oh, I'm bleeding out.